Hello, everybody, and yeah, welcome to the show. This will be One, two, probably three. our third podcast that we're doing so far. Today, we are going to be doing a podcast about the new Webcam Max version. Now, before we start, we do have a special guest, and that is, he's right here, Poke, 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 Poke. His name is Champagne, and he is our special guest, as long, along with our COO, um, a.k.a. Furious, who's usually in here, CB14, ow, stop looking at me, <laughs> CB14 couldn't make it right now, um, so we, we decided to exclude him, he'll be in, you know, any other of our episodes and stuff, of course. And I'm the replacement. Yes, CB, you've changed so much. <laughs> Okay, so today we're going to be talking about the new <laughs> Webcam Max version um, that was released, version 4.4.1.1, I believe. And we just thought um, we'd let you know about our experiences with it. So, uh, without further ado, Champagne, our special guest, would you like to take it away? Um, first uh, pro I'd like to talk about is the, uh, the, the user interface. For the new webcam max it's a uh, user friendly nice icons it's simple to use the old one it's uh, just you know like a big brick of program you know yes yes um, I do we do have some pros and cons here so we don't leave you hanging um, uh, one pro is it's got a new GUI it's customizable like you can change you can choose different themes which is actually quite good because the version I'm currently using right now is 3.5 and it's it's got that bluish bluish look second one is it's stable uh, it, for me well yes it's stable and apparently that is a big con that champagne a few others have said is uh it is unstable um, for some pros though the second pro would be that the picture in picture for second webcam if you'd like to put a second webcam effects in, is um, a pro. yeah, it's got apparently it's got a lot more newer effects, things like that, which is good. A third thing I have here is the ability to draw. You can actually highlight. You know when uh, you're playing that football game and it comes to that that point and it happens and they have to kind of rewind and they have like the person that's drawing with a little marker and stuff. You have that ability too, so it's pretty neat. Um, it's. It's a newer version, and of course, with new versions, you're gonna have bugs. Unfortunately, it always happens. Um, I have to say, the version that I'm stuck with is 3.5 right now, because uh, one of the pros that I think it has, or sorry, not pros, cons. Now, it's still a good program. I'm not saying anything bad about it. One of the cons is the fact that you can't do multiple screen captures. You can either use a picture in picture to capture your second uh, uh, webcam. Or screenshot you can't do multiple screenshots and the way this is set up with um, our system here is we have um, I have aka furious is on my top screen there he's captured in a window which you can see in my corner here get my fingering right here and um, we have down here um, champagne sorry I almost forgot your name he's also in screenshots so we can do multiple screenshots and do multiple things are you poking me again ah that hurt <laughs> <laughs> so that's the c the con oh. that I I think is is kind of a problem. I'm sure it will get better. I don't know why um, they took that feature out. Champagne, what do you think? Why why like why did they do that? Why they did they did. take the multiple um, screen Maybe capture capability out? Maybe because they took it. Okay. Well, I'm not sure. I never uh, played with it yet. Are you sure you guys? it's not there or did you guys just not see it i don't know why they would uh take it out well, without having a like super maybe valid because reason it well, it's i maybe I, it could CB have made could the tell program us. unstable if cb was here it could have made the program unstable that could be one point cb could let us know like um he says yeah you can't do that um and apparently you can do your, your captures for the the things. I mean, I, I can email them and let them know about it, about, you know, some things that are different and everything. But in all of our, I think Webcam X is probably one of the best versions for a PC out there. Um, besides that being the best Mac version to do all this is Can Twist, which I never hear enough of. Uh, because so many people say it's good, unfortunately. Right, Cam Twist is supposedly the best thing in the computers right now. 
Yeah, but unfortunately, it's only available for Mac. Right, so I would get it. I mean, webcam Max is great. I think right. they need to they need to kind of upgrade a bit because some people were talking about um, RSS feeds being able to have the RSS feeds in much like. But Cantus. it will it, it will always be available for Mac or yes. Unix. But I think webcam Max can and kind I'm of a break Linux that barrier. Fanatic. Yes, um, Furious here. He is quite the Linux guy. I mean. Oh yeah. So on that note, we just like to say, you know, if you're something, someone that's into customizing and likes the whole color Tech. feature thing, um, you know, by all means, give it a try. Um, you should I like, use this program. <laughs> yes, very much so. I mean, I give them kudos, kudos galore, because of you know its its functionality and stuff. Probably not primarily the desktop capturing and stuff. And, you know, uh, I use the old version, which, you know, I like Webcam Max, and the new version may be better for you if you're not a person who likes to do multiple screen captures. You might have a second webcam to have that on, and, you know, you, you want to draw on your screen and stuff, and, and Yahoo or whatever program you use to stream or whatever, just to wow your friends. Webcam Max, it, you can get a trial version. It is, um... You do have to pay for it. There is a, a free program that's similar to it, not as much. It's called Manicam, M-A-N-Y-C-A-M. It's got a few effects. It's kind of neat to use. That's that's the free version. Anyways, if you have a comment or anything, let us know. You can email us at info at macintech.net. You can stop by our website. It is macintech.net, M-C-I-N-T-E-C, dot net. Uh, we have or a you whole can email one of us. Yep. Yeah. We, which is um, aka furious at macatech.net our website has been redesigned and everything so hopefully it'll be a lot better you can also go to live.macatech.net and you can see our, our live stream and chat page where you can actually chat in our chat room we are on the wild ride irc network our network name is pound macintech m-c-i-n-t-e-c -E so you don't get confused with macintech so hopefully that that gets you thinking a little bit more about webcam max and its capabilities and thanks sam payne for being on the show as one of our guests no problem man yeah Anytime. hopefully we can get him on here you know more often because he's a cool techie guy too just like the rest of us all here and actually if you want to request to be on a show live show and uh recorded show go ahead just drop by our chat room when when we're here usually i'm here um, usually I'm up in the Eastern Standard Time to like, what, four in the morning, stuff like that, <laughs> and then I, I'm gone most of the day, but, you know, just send me an email, mine is jason at macintech.net, aka furious is aka furious at macintech.net, or you can just type furious at macintech.net. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed the video, and let us know. Thanks, we'll chat at you later.